Hi guys, Postman's Bin. I ordered four items off eBay recently. Uh, three digital clock kits and a card reader. I suspect this will be the card reader because I think the digital clock kits are probably coming from China. Uh, we'll find out, won't we? Yep, yeah, this is the card reader. I got some Kiwi Bird card readers that plug straight into my phone uh, via the USB C port. But the one that I plug into my computer that I bought fairly recently died within about, well, within a week. Um, it was a cheap one, so I thought I'd buy one that was a little bit more expensive. And the Kiwi Bird ones I bought for the phone have been absolutely fine. It's a bit fancy, this one. It does multiple uh, USB ports. So you've got USB-C, so I can plug it into my phone if I want. And then that'll plug into your ordinary USB-A, or whatever it is. And also, this bit folds down if I can do it. There we go. So you've got a micro USB. I can't imagine wanting to use that nowadays. But it's there. And then we got micro SD card goes in there. And your normal SD card goes in there. Yeah, I don't know why, but the, the cheap one I bought uh, must have been a couple of months ago now. Quite quickly, the this port failed on it. I can only assume the little brass fingers in there got bent or something. But I was quite disappointed. The micro SD still works on it, but that one, it just doesn't work. Anyway, we'll give this one a try. Make sure it works. I'll put a note in the video description. Uh, I won't give you a direct link to the seller because I don't try and support um, eBay sellers, not directly. But I'll give you the details so you can look it up yourself and probably find it cheaper somewhere else. I just had a thought. We could just have a look at this one. This is the one that's failed. Because I've just noticed that looks a little bit flexible there. And there's nothing much in them, to be honest. So I was, I was guessing that maybe some of these little fingers were bent. And they look okay. Let's go in a bit closer. I think they look okay. So that's flexing a little bit, but I don't think that's actually a problem. 
So say the the micro SD works fine. It's this one that's playing up. I mean, how can it play up? <laughs> There's nothing there. Just some flexible fingers. Or is the one right in the corner there missing? No, there isn't one there. I thought there might have been one missing there for a minute, but there isn't one right up there. Yeah, don't know why it fails, but it does. If you wiggle it around a little bit, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. So... Yeah. Anyway, we'll give this one a try. I'm just looking at this again. This is the one that's 40. And those three solder joints look a bit suspect. I don't think that's the problem, but it's just interesting that those three don't look like they've flowed properly. And then we look in here. I just notice that one just there seems lower. The little springy fingers. So whether that one's not making good contact. We just sort of go along looking at the heights. That one does seem lower. We're in focus there. The others all seem to be springing up well. And that one just seems lower. I might try just bending that up a bit, put a pin under it to bend it up, see if that makes any difference. If it does, I'll put a note in the video description. All right, can we see this? I've reflowed the solder on those tags that looked a little bit suspect. I've also used a pin to go in there and try and push that finger up that seemed to be a little bit low. And I've tried it. And it seems to work now. So whether it was the finger that was loose or whether reflowing those tags has helped, I don't know which it was, but it seems to work. This does seem to be very loose in there. But yeah, having done that, it, it certainly worked. So I'm going to put it back together and continue to use it. But if it fails again, I'll put a note in the video description. Yeah, that, that seems very loose in there. Doesn't seem to grip it. So it may be that those little fingers aren't very strong. That almost feels like it'll fall out. It doesn't feel very tight in there at all. So thanks for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe, leave us a comment so I know how I'm doing and 
somewhere up here there'll be some links to related playlists. Thanks again.